Oh, well, what? Blockbusters or friendlies? No, friendlies. Yeah, I mean, and, and that place has not been updated since like 1980. No. Yeah. It looked and it had and there was water dripping from the ceiling. I thought I was crazy, and someone said, "You see that?" I said, "Did I see that?" I know I'm not crazy now. Did you see like water? Yep, water dripping from the ceiling. That's gross. No wonder why they didn't put us right there. Terrible. So guys, yeah, friendly is not so good. Good ice cream though. And you can see them make the ice cream right there in front of you. But I prefer like mom and pop ice cream shops. Yeah, uh, no speed cream everything. If you're, if you're back in TR, if you want to get good ice cream, Riches. Yeah, I'll, we'll be going more because it's free. It's a free place to stay. That's awesome. Yeah, but there's no furniture. Six, by the way. So you know what I do? So we have air mattresses. Air mattresses. Cool. There's no fridge either. Okay. So we we just have like a cooler. Yeah. I don't care. It doesn't bother me. It's a place to scrap. Well, apparently, apparently, my friends, uh, apparently, the 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 mother died in the in that house. She they found her like she she died in her sleep. So it does, but it's, it freaks them out a little bit. Like, don't freak me out. I don't know her. I didn't know her. I don't got to pay for a hotel. Hell yeah. It smells a little bit like cigarettes because she apparently smoked. It's all right. Well, let's spray a little. Put a little water on that. You're okay. You save at least hundred bucks for especially this time of uh, I know. And and if you go to the shore and it, you know you go early enough you get cheaper parking. Yeah. Cuz otherwise it's like 15 bucks to park there. At least. Yeah, it's terrible. Oh, their french fries were good, but again, I have no idea who prepared them. That was the problem. And I'm on my phone looking to see like what the what the laws are in New Jersey about food prep and stuff so I could like have a conversation with her. We're like, yeah, so I know you're supposed to wear gloves. I definitely know you're not supposed to touch your food with your your nose and then touch the food. That I know. Yeah, but I wouldn't do that in my own house. That's just common sense. That's gross. You first lick your fingers and at least lick, or at least pick your nose first. Don't just touch the tip of it. <laughs> Put some protein in there. <laughs> Rush, first card for you under the gum. Next time I ask them if they're cooked is serve safe certified. Is what? Serve safe certified. Oh, I know that. I saw that I knew that. Like Definitely the, was not. It's like the scene from Roche. He had a hat on backwards, no gloves. Uh, it's like you're not supposed to. You shouldn't be wearing a hat. Cause Actually, you are. No, well, shouldn't you be wearing a net? A hair net. Uh, his hair net and hat. He I had mean, no hair net. He just had a baseball cap on backwards. Well, there you go. Is that, that good works. enough? That that it, works, some places it is, yeah. I guess friendlies it is. There you go. Yeah. Uh-huh. As long as you're keeping the hair back somehow. Wayne. He got facial hair. Uh, he had a mustache. Nah, you don't put a beard net on for a mustache. You can't cover a mustache. I've seen, I've seen Wawa people do that. <clears throat> that's that's dumb. Here's another Dennis Leonard. You saw what? You saw people Wawa. People at Wawa, they put the they have a facial hair. Yo, let me tell you something about Wawa. Wawa is fantastic. We don't have Wawa in New York. You guys got it on. We just started getting them in Edison. Love Wawa. I never heard of Wawa until I started doing consulting a few years ago, and I go down to Pennsylvania, yes, and we go to Jersey, and we'd stop at Wawa, and I work with this guy, uh, Lou, he's a weird dude. So this guy I work with, what he used to do was, he was like a 40, like a 55, 60-year-old man. He would order chicken chicken nuggets when we go out to like dinner. When you consult, you go out with the guys you consult with, that's Rush, that's for you. We go to like crappy places like Bennigan's, not Bennigan's, like Applebee's. He'd order the nuggets, but he'd cut the nuggets into little pieces. Hmm. It's a grown man, like 60 years old, father, grandfather, and he would eat them that way. And he would go to Wawa every morning and get like a 72-ounce uh, Diet Coke, and he'd refill it throughout the day. His insides must have looked like, I don't know, like an empty forest or something. Just terrible. No trees. He's the Hall of Famer, Dave Winfield. Terrible stuff. But he loved Wawa just for those drinks. I'm not a big soda guy. I don't drink soda. That's right. You drink them Arizona iced teas. Here's Ron LaFleur. Nothing. A nice gift. What are you guys talking about, gifts? I don't even get a gift. Ron LaFleur. He was in prison, Ron LaFleur. I think they found him. I think he was literally in. I think he was literally in prison where they and they discovered him or something. Here's Tom Bergmeier, Claude Washington, former Yankee. He's a good player for a number of years. Here's Terry Forster, another Hall of Famer to round out the pack. Dennis Eckersley.
Dennis E. The Eck for Lewis. 79 baseball, 264. Ha ha ha!